Do you guys want your vehicle to look like the Batmobile? Well today I bring you a guide on what to do to shoot electric and look like a complete badass. Check this out. How's it going guys, my name's DP Jen, I'd like to thank you for stopping by and checking out the video. If you enjoy it, leaving a like truly really helps out, and subscribe if you want more Borderlands 3 videos. Also, I am giving away copies of Borderlands to win one for yourself or a friend. Simply subscribe and make sure you have the notifications turned on, drop a like on the video and leave a comment down below. Okay, so as you know, stealing vehicles, finding hidden vehicles and much more will in fact then unlock said vehicle parts for you once you take them to a cash a ride. Today I bring you the locations needed for you to have your vehicle to literally look like the Christian Bale Batmobile. Okay so this vehicle is the Outrunner, the first vehicle you actually get in the game I believe. The driver's weapon though is where the fun starts, this is called the Tesla coil and well it fires electric and it's pretty damn amazing. Now both the Tesla coil and the Omni wheels which allow you to hover are found within the same location and that's a Necro, Tafio, wherever that's pronounced, I don't know, I'm not even sure to be honest, I'm probably wrong anyway. And it's within the Desolations Edge area. Here just drive around the spot I've marked on the map and you will come across loads of enemies in all kinds of vehicles but obviously you are looking for the Outrunner. Now Omni wheels are kind of easy to find as they kind of stand out. But the Tesla coil isn't and unless the driver fires you won't know it's actually there. And because most of the time the driver never actually shoots, I suggest hijacking and checking every outrunner you come across just to see if it has the coils. So once you find these parts simply hijack and park them within that catch a ride so you unlock said parts. The mod being the energy cells is also located within this area. This allows you to press that left bumper on console which just sends out a pulse of electricity which is absolutely ridiculously powerful by the way. So head to the spot I mark on a map right now following the route I take. the maggot. Whoa, Once you are here, you will see there's a yellow force field locking you out from the vehicle. What you have to do is shoot these three electronic fence generators but you have to shoot all three within a certain time otherwise they turn back on. So shoot all three as quick as you can and the fence will deactivate. Then simply jump in the vehicle and go to that catcher ride right nearby.
Now the heavy armor which finishes the lock is located on Pandora within the Ascension Bluff area. Spawn in and travel to this spot as I do, you can see on screen now. Once you are here people, you then have to open this gate via the button located up top. So jump up, press this button, open that fence, jump in the vehicle and drive to this catch a ride which is right in front of you. And guys, you are complete. Now you just need to apply any paint job, some better than others obviously, and just make it all black. And there you have it guys, you have an amazing looking ride which looks like the Batmobile. And it is really a monster killing machine. The Tesla coil is a beast, but the engine styles are just monstrous. So have fun, people. And on that note, guys, we have come to the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want more Borderlands 3 videos, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one. down there.